What you're trying to say is that you fell here from another world? But when you wanted to leave and go on to the next world, your path was blocked by some unknown god? Outlanders, your journey ends here. Who are you? The sustainer of heavenly principles. The irrigation of mankind ends now. Just like that, a god took away my sister. Some kind of seal was cast upon me, and I lost my power. So while we used to travel from world to world, we are now trapped here. How many years ago was it? I don't know. But I intend to find out. When I woke, I was all alone. Until I met you two months ago. Yeah, Paimon really owes you for that. Otherwise, Paimon likely would have drowned. So Paimon will do her best to be a great guy. We should head off. Let's get going. Keep this close. Depletes stamina, and depleted stamina takes time to recover. Okay, let's take the route we planned. 
We're off to a statue of the seven. Which of the seven are you looking for exactly? Oh, wow. That's a statue of the seven. Statues scattered across the land to show the Seven's protection over the world. Among the Seven Gods, this God controls the wind. Paimon's not sure whether the God you're looking for is the Animal God, but... Paimon will take you to the Animal God's place first, and there's a the reason why. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. Did you just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of animal. As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh-huh. It's because you're not from this world to begin with. If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the city of freedom. Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of animal. So perhaps because you got power from the god of animal, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then! The elements in this world responded to your prayers and... These are the animal powers you got from the Statue of the Seven. Oh, Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers? We must proceed with caution. 
on the road. I'll keep this close. Is this an answer from this world? Keep this close. Keep this close. <laughs> Is this an answer from this world? Yeah. 
I'll keep this close. I'll keep this close. Is this an answer from this world? Reward on the road.
I'll keep this close. Keep this close. Board on the road. I'll keep this close. Is this an answer from this world? from this world?
reward on the road. Is this an answer from this world? to the dragon <sighs> of course not oh what's that there's some kind of shiny red thing let's go take a closer look be careful Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this Paimon's never seen a stone like this before so Paimon can't tell what it is all Paimon knows is that it's dangerous best we put it away for now Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. I'll keep this close. protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? I mean, we've only been traveling partners for two months, but... We've already become the very best of friends. So to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. 
I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable traveler. That sounded so fake. Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? He got separated from his sister during a really, really long journey. Paimon is his travel buddy, helping him to find his sister. Oh, looking for your family? Huh. Uh... Okay, let me finish my other stuff first, and then I can help you put up posters around the city. What exactly is it you need to finish doing first? It's simple. You'll understand in a bit. Uh, a hilly churl. Quick, get it! These monsters have been getting too close to the city recently. My task this time is to clear out their camp. a little with your moves thanks for the backup how'd it feel now that you mention it how is it the hilly trails ended up here these creatures don't seem like the type to set up camp so close to cities like this exactly it's more normal for them to be much but because the dragon storm terror has been around a lot when the storms hit we usually end up with at least a few injuries so the knights of favonius have been tied up doing the best they can so these annoying creatures have been getting closer and closer to the city exactly that said, clearing this camp helped make the area a little bit safer. Come with me. A responsible knight must make sure to see you to the city safely. Another target tracked down by Outrider... later. Huh. 
adventuring on an empty stomach. What should I... Oh, are you travelers from around here as well? No, we just happen to be passing by. I see. Welcome to... I'm Lynn, the survive... Eat before... Picnic? Oh, my travel partner here is good at cooking... That's okay. Look, you won't get a lot of chances. There are some mushrooms and meat in the barrel over there. Is it done? Let me try. Hmm. Oh, hmm. Uh, now that's really tasty. Hi, Montoya. With your culinary. Oh, I've got. Can we really have? That's okay. There's also a restaurant. Okay. Thank you for the info. <gasps> Introduce the city of wind, dandelions, and freedom. Travelers under the protection of the Knights of Havonius, welcome to Mondstadt. Finally, no more having to camp outdoors. But the city folk don't look too cheery. Everyone's been put out of place by storm terror recently, but everything will turn out fine as long as Jean's with us. Jean? Acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. With Jean on our side, surely even the vicious Storm Terror will be no match for us. Before I take you guys to the Knights of Favonius headquarters, I have a present for you, Traveler. It's a reward for helping me clear out that Hillitrol camp. H hey! Why doesn't Paimon get a reward? Uh, because this reward is useless to you, Pi- But I'll treat you to a traditional Mondstadt delicacy. Sticky honey roast. Sticky honey roast! Come with me. We'll head to the city's, uh, high ground. This used to be a bustling street, but with so many storm terror attacks recently, the usual... Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there, they haven't been affected. If anything, their business is better than ever. give you is a wind glider outriders use them to ride the wind and the people of Mondstadt love using them too 
I brought you here to give it to you, so you can experience it right away. Oh, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. Oh. Alrighty then, enough talk. Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. actually got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm? Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself! Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time! Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. From afar? Is that all we know of them? Uh, long story short... I see. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. Oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters.
Is this an answer from this world? Is this an answer from this world? This seems to be the Knights of Favonia's headquarters. Let's head in. Jean, what's the hurry? I thought we agreed to meet them here. There have been sightings of storm terror outside the city. Once we meet, we must... Relax. I'll lend a hand when the time comes. Jean, I've brought them. <sighs> and once it was over, I brought them straight here. Mondstadt welcomes you, Windborn Travelers. I am Jean, acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. This is Lisa, our resident librarian. <laughs> oh, are you sweeties here to help us out? <laughs> You're both so adorable. Sadly, the timing is regrettable. Storm Terror has caused quite a ruckus in the region since its recent resurgence. Simply put, Mondstadt's elemental sphere and ley lines are now akin to a yarn ball in the paws of a kitten. For a mage, it couldn't get much worse. My skin is one elemental particle away from a full-blown breakout. <sighs> if it weren't for this interference, the Knights of Favonius would have better ways to help you than just putting up missing person posters. We simply ask that you repose in Mondstadt while we help you seek out your sister. Too. Good. In that case, we need a plan. With Storm Terror now directly attacking Mondstadt, we may have an opportunity to cut this problem off at the source. Lisa has revealed the sources of Storm Terror's power. Is that so? They're located in the abandoned Four Winds Temples. Storm Terror's ability to whip up these kinds of storms can be attributed to it drawing power from the temples. Our objective is to deal with three of the four temples. I trust everyone understands why we are only dealing with three. Paimon doesn't. Knights of Favonius, time is against us. The storm is rampant. There is no point in maintaining a defensive position. All right, we need to take initiative and act before the situation escalates.
From now on, the adventures... We can run some tests? We could start by going to Mondstadt's blacksmith! One of the deserted temples of the Four Winds. These temples have been left to waste for years now. There's a chance there's a monster nest or hillatrol camp. <sighs> Even Storm Terror has given up on it. Yes, I also find it hard to accept. Huh? Wait! Did you the wind here? Let's go in and take a look. Be careful. The dragon's power is disturbing this area. Yeah! Huh. 
prepared my secret weapon, Explosive Puppet Buried Bunny. we've helped Jean out. In the past, we were at least able to defend the city and keep it safe. This, of course, is mostly thanks to Jean, but now with Storm Terror directly attacking the city itself, the winds change. So too should our tactics. It's what Lisa likes to say. Speaking of which, the four winds we were discussing earlier, if you want to learn more about our history, you can ask Lee. I'm not saying I don't know our history. It's just, I, I mean... A librarian is supposed to be more knowledgeable than an outrider. like unwrapping a gift.
I'll keep this close. You've arrived. Come closer. Can you smell that? Something must have happened in the t I imagine there will be slimes, hilly churls, and whatever's giving Storm Terror extra power. Oh yes, it is going to be lively in there indeed. As bustling as it may be, no, I can't imagine it will be dangerous at all. It's a pity that the Temple of the Wolf has been disturbed by such an atrocity. Let's head in. No one makes offerings to the Four Winds anymore. Yet the old winds never vanish. We need to clear out the temples for the four winds. Let me show you how the Knights of Favonius...
If I'm not mistaken, at the end of the temple should be up there. Wait, how do you know? <laughs> Experience. Traveler, unless I'm mistaken, you don't seem to have a vision. So how exactly is it that you're able to channel elemental energy? It was a very strange occurrence. Ah, finally, we're here. Seems the path ends here. Let's use the wind currents to fly up. Idea. That's some keen observation. We should get Jean to give you a title and make you a knight. Speaking of, did you know? Storm Terror was once one of the four winds. I'm not aware of the exact details. If you're interested, you can ask the acting Grand Master about it. Is that the thing that Storm Terror is using to gain its power? Bravo! What a performance! You are, to my surprise, a well-trained knight. The battles you just fought were sights to behold. I see you already have the knightly virtue of modesty. The stories of your heroic deeds to save Mondstadt from destruction shall be known throughout the City of Freedom. Please do visit me at our headquarters when you have the time. I also know a lovely tavern, if that's more your thing. Quite rewarding, no? We've seized another temple from Storm Terror's grasp! I can take care of the rest here. You go take care of other things while I'm at it. See you later then, bye-bye! There's no way Hilly Turtles organized an ambush like this themselves. Not with their limited mental capacity. <laughs> Thus you were behind this. Knights of Avonius, always so inefficient. Agree to disagree, but your involvement in this just made things a whole lot more interesting. Ready when you are.
Opening a chest is like a unwrapping a gift. Keep this close. Fortunate. the blessings of the seven? In Mondstadt, people call them animuncula. They can be fitted into the statue's eyes. Some stories say the statue's eyes originally had gems that were taken by swallows, but animuncula never had a physical form from the start. People with visions collect them to offer to the statues as blessings. But and the rules of this world don't up.
quite the find. You're going to don't hesitate to come to me if you need any good basic so as you wish. needs assistance I guess I could give I knew it there is a strong elemental energy coming from deep within this temple let's ride this wind current shall we with a bit of electro power. Stand back, sweeties. Wet enemies, I've got them covered. Steady as stone. Someone needs assistance. 
distance. Oh, another wind current. Let's ride it up from here. Closer. <laughs> Chain lightning can be set off between electrocharged opponents. The electrical discharge caused by friction is only a little less shocking than love at first sight. You want to know about this gem? You're kidding. You're seriously asking? This is a vision. It's used by the Chosen to draw on elemental powers. In terms of mysticism, I suppose you could call it a magical lightning rod. seen a vision? Just where exactly are you from? Are you a hilly churl with some level of reasonable intelligence? No, I doubt it. After all, hilly churls aren't exactly known for their smarts. And you, you more or less qualify to be a magister's approach. Break it, and we can head home and relax. Dragon of the East, Lion of the South, Wolf of the North, Falcon of the West. They are the four winds of Mondstadt, affiliated with Barbados, the god of anima. The dragon of the East, Storm Terror, its real name is Devalin. Though most in Mondstadt seem to have forgotten that in all this Storm Terror business. So now you know why Devalin is only able to channel three of the four winds' power. Because it has been consuming itself from the beginning. Because of hatred, I presume. Hatred? Hatred for Mondstadt. Hatred drove it to become something more powerful than the wind itself. But why would one of the four winds hate the city it was supposed to protect? Uh... As a child of Mondstadt, it's something that's really hard to say aloud. Here, take this. It's a very old story from more than a century ago. Well, all that. Want to go back and see all the knights, but if you got anything more interesting to do, Paimon can come too. By the way, we obtained another animunculus in one of the Four Winds temples. We might come across more of them in the future, so don't forget to offer them to the statue. <laughs> Another 
Another target tracked down by Outrider Amber. Keep an eye on you. No pain, no gain. <laughs> Is this an answer from this world? from this world?
reward on the road. <laughs> go, go, bear! Ugh, not so hard! Ha! You're in for a little shock. <laughs> You've been a naughty boy. Don't be such a brute. Come a little closer. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, cutie? This statue of the Seven seems to be affected by a monster nearby. Defeating that monster might remove this strange wind current seal thingy around the statue of the Seven. Yeah. <laughs> Come a little close. Dodge this! <laughs> You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. <laughs> Come a little closer. Yep. <laughs> You've been a naughty boy.
Another target tracked down by Outrider Amber. You've had your... Oh, that is not what I meant at all. Bing, when I look at you... Paimon sees it. Paimon always feels... Nevertheless, to the... You must accumulate advent... Time is of the essence. Wait, are you saying... Do not worry. The adventure... In short, there are lots of benefits. Basically, the Adventurer's Guild rewards you every time your adventure rank increases. Here is a new member's gift for you. You will need to return here to claim rewards in the future. Well... Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. Here is your Adventurer Handbook. A new member coming aboard is- It has a record of available commissions and rewards. Without further ado- Oh, and sometimes you will find yourself stuck at a certain adventure. When this happens, you need to perform some impressive feats to gain further recognition- Impressive feats? They are simply specific adventures that allow you to ascend to the next adventure rank, but that will come later. Opportunities to win rec- That will do for today. Add Astra Abyssosk, and it is also proof of your membership. <laughs> Can your cooking? Why don't you? Urine for a little shot. <laughs> What's the <laughs>
This is bad. So oh, thank the Thousand Wind. If I may ask, Envoy said. Ew, cut it out. Marvelous. I cannot let my peers hear about this. Please, let us move to some. Let's talk in the courtyard. What's with this sneak? This place will do. Tell us what it's about already. How should I begin? Oh, right. Let me tell you a secret first. It's a secret of my past, and I confide in you to keep it. Don't worry. Paimon's lips are sealed. As a matter of fact, my grandfather was a pirate. Oh. Wait, why do you sound so blithe? Do you think I'm making it up? Look at my eye patch. I inherited it from my grandfather, and this is solid proof. Yesterday, I was glancing through the notes my grandfather left and stumbled upon records that spoke of a treasure. Treasure? According to his notes, the treasure is buried in the lost ark. Treasure. But the location of the ruins is currently unknown. I've tried searching for clues. Treasure! Kaya, what kind of treasure is it? Gold? Or better yet, gems? <laughs> Treasures that consist of nothing but gold and gems are third-rate. My grandfather's treasure is a, a magic sword that grants the wielder unrivaled power. Oh, wow! The sword was dropped from Celestia into the sea by a god. It was later salvaged by my grandfather's crew. The moment he gripped the sword, thunder roared, billowed with the might of the magic sword. My grandfather went on to defeat a hydra. A silver-haired banshee, a wick But the immense power of the sword enticed many more greedy pop to avoid meaningless conflicts. My grandfather, the world we live in is fascinating. Holy moly! A gang of treasure hoarders has been very active lately, and I'm afraid that they will soon discover the Arcadian. We won't let it fall into the wrong hands. We must get the sword. You just rest assured that we- Wow. Great. Please keep it a secret. Hey, so what you think? Isn't it exciting? Well, let's go to the Adventurers Guild and see. The adventurers should know more about the route. Hey, Kido. Hmm. We're not here for... We're looking for a sword that fell from Sol... It's super mega uber... It's fine. So, Cyrus, do you know where the lost... Arcadian, thanks for your intel and... Uh... Still no clues. Well, it's not like it's gonna be easy. Come on, it's the hiding place of the super amazing sword. We should go meet up with Kaya first. Oh, you're back. Listen, we asked around the adventures. <laughs> the Why is that? Oh, I only mean, however, I do have some clue. I sent some. Really? Where's the gun? Now, now, we will be meeting the informant. Then what are we waiting here for? That's right. 
You read my- I am a knight, so I shouldn't have- You have my th Of course, you'll be compensated for your troubles. Why is this happening? Thanks so much for it's nothing. Traveler, I've heard stories about you. Oh! <laughs> I didn't know how I people in our circle know how important the network is. Lucky, but it's lucky for Kaya, isn't it? <laughs> Listen well then. The in three six armed giants reside. Right! There's also this map that came with it. Could this. So the clue. Well, should be a piece of cake for you, right? Well, if you can't solve it, I'll leave you the intel. Thanks, my three. What does that mean? She doesn't love him at all. The passion rushing. There's another map. More. Paimon's dizzy already. Paimon will let you have all the fun. Oh. <laughs> Is this an answer from this world? Windblade! Freeze! Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Blitz. Keep this close. This time, the mysteries are all been solved. But in all fairness, this treasure map rips so now. Hmm. Let's go for it. Like, like, anyways, Paimon just what? No, you are nothing. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Arcadian treasure hunt. Yeah. Yeah. Dodge this! 
come a little closer. Try not to enjoy this too much. <laughs> this one will be frozen. Come a little closer. <laughs> A little close. You're in for a little. How fortunate. Catch the wind. for justice. Goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
the Arcadian ruins. Is it just me? Or does it look plain? Oh, Paimon gets it. The perfect disguise is always in plain sight. Kaya's grandpa sure is impressive. Oh, mice! Uh, it's no time to get suspicious. We're close. Hurry, the treasure is waiting for us. Been a naughty boy. He, yeah, you. Rain outlines your fate. How about you let me take over? Sharp eye, but time izzard. I thank you both on behalf- Ah, uh, we've been keeping a low profile. How did word get out? Hmm, Paimon won't let you have the treasure with- You would be wise not to underestimate us. My gang is just outside waiting for my order. However, they're not as uh, sociable as me. I'm sorry to rain on your parade. But your gang won't be participating in your current plan. If you'd like to ask why, you can go see them. In Mons, or perhaps you'd prefer to join them permanently. The Knights. Hey, it's Kaya! Kaya, he wants to see your... Oh, almost had it. Oh, you mean the treasure. Sorry, but there wasn't any treasure to begin with. You came all the way for nothing. Just... What? No... Treasure? Did Kaya just say there isn't any treasure? Huh. <laughs> it got me good. Didn't think the knights would resort to such tactics. A thief has no right to criticize the methods of the knights of Favon. 
Wait, what are you- You're not gonna get me! Okay, oh god, what, what is this? I didn't mean it! <laughs> what a troublemaker. You, Knight! You're not gonna watch me die, are ya? Hmm, what an interesting suggestion. Fine, I I'll confess and go quietly. Please, just help me! All right then. Guess I will have to do some overtime work after all. How embarrassing. Having my life saved by a knight. Don't forget what you promised. Or that thing will be the least of your worries. Hey, is this how the Knights of Favonius treats the people? <laughs> I'm just joking. Sir! Yes, sir! Uh, Captain, should we take these two in as well? Uh, what? <laughs> of course not. They are the ones who made this arrest possible. Without them spreading our fabricated intel, we wouldn't have been able to catch the treasure hoarders. Ah, you're a bad man for lying to me! Shame on the night! All right, all right, stop it already. Though the treasure doesn't exist, you did want it for yourself, didn't you? Otherwise, you would have informed me of your intentions, no? That? Well, uh, let's go. Paimon's done talking to him. <laughs> Just a sec. You did help me out, so you do deserve a reward. This is the triumphant harbinger of dawn that points towards victory. If you don't mind, I would like to present you with this harbinger of dawn. That's right. It suits a well-cultured and disciplined person such as yourself. Wouldn't you say, Paimon? Well, if the reward is this Harbinger of Dawn... You'd forgive me, right? I'm honored to have such an understanding friend. Yes, yes. You have my apologies for the deception. I will not use the same method twice. What a wonderful day. Now, I have to go interrogate my suspect. Please excuse me. Do come visit me at our headquarters when you have the chance. Time to act. Look! Doesn't that shop look interesting? Let's see what they're selling! Add a... Welcome. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what did I tell you? These are all rare. Is there anything that catches your eye? No need. 
I forgot to mention, I operate... I've been trying to make something a bit special recently. Do you have any Animo sigils with you? <laughs> More to the point, any animal sigils you find, you can trade in... sigils appear all over absolutely what could be more beautiful <laughs> okay you got me it's actually more complicated than that obviously the reason i need animo sigils is because they have properties that other materials cannot provide <laughs> of course do come again soon and bring please also visit if you come across any weird and wonderful treasures on your adventure <laughs> Over there. Wow, he does bes- Of course. I sell weapons, make them to order, and do refinements. All you need is the ore. Anywhere. <sighs> you look- Bring some back and I'll help you f No need. I have- What do you want? Oh, yeah. These are okay, I guess. you ever find ideally when I'm not busy a blacksmith's work takes focus and concentration when the craft is good business is good that's all there is to this trade and anyone who tells you different is trying to con you now if there's nothing else I'll carry on he's certainly committed to it body and mind his temper isn't great, but leave it to him and he'll be able to forge what you need.
traveler. I've been looking for you everywhere. How's that wind glider I gave you last time? <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you. But then again, you don't have a gliding license, do you? A gliding license? Hmm, what's that? <sighs> Isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to legally glide in Mondstadt. Oh, but we've been gliding for ages now. This is the first we've heard about it. Yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. Everyone's noticed. <laughs> So, you came looking for us because you want to give us a gliding license? No way! The Knights of Favonius have strict rules. You need to pass an exam, and only then will the Knights issue your license. Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official gliding exam. I gave you your wing glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what Acting Grandmaster Jean would say. An exam?! <sighs> what a pain in the butt! Then I get I'm sure you'll glide through it. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the day that Storm Terror attacked, so I'm sure you'll have... But we do need to respect the rules and glide properly. Here, take this gliding manual. No need to memorize it. Just be familiar with everything in there. For example, only one person per wing glider. No carrying anything over the set weight limit. No taking off using an animal slime, and so on and so forth. Anyway, be sure to read it, okay? I had to read a load of big, thick books, too, when Lisa... Wow, that's a big old book! Great, come find me when you're done. I'll be at wit... <sighs> the Knights of Favonius Gliding Manual does not sound like a fun read. When the first wisp of wind brushed across the land, birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They asked the animal god, how can we reach the heavens? To which the animal god replied, you have yet to find that which is most important. As the god spoke, the wind thrust the seeds of a dandelion high into the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge, where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves off the cliff and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal god they went to gleefully say, We understand now. All we needed was a stronger wind to fly. In reply, the animal god said, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. That's a cool story. Huh. Anyway, let's go find Amber. Time to act.
here. Did you have a good read-through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules down? Sounds like it was a real drag. Ugh, the gliding manual is super dry. I couldn't get into it. Really? Hmm, Paimon thought cool stories? Oh, you must... Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal in Apparently, if you pop an animal slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I really want to try it. No, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to... Uh... What? Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used to read as a kid. Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same pile and must have grabbed the wrong one when I was leaving. How in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story with an instruction manual? Uh, uh, it's because maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is the thing that truly... What you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to become the... Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champ... Uh, but... Anyway, let's don't be nervous. Just glop. Okay then. You just need to follow the marked route. The next part of the exam is... Alrighty then, you heard her! Back to the thing! Beep, let's not keep her waiting! Just keep thinking about that like Windborne Traveler. You are required to land at once by the order of the Knights of Favonius. I am Otto of the... Uh, let's go... Please, show me your gliding license. It is against the law to glide without a license. I am arresting you under Section 7, Article... You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will forever... Wait, I'm an instructor. This is a gliding... Ex oh, I see. Well, you picked a bad time to hold your gliding exam. Really? Why? The Knights of Favonius received a report from a sister at the cathedral, claiming she saw Raptor gliding around these parts. Raptor? A known criminal in Mondstadt. He always uses a wind glider to commit his crimes, so... Wow, he flies fast then. So far, we haven't managed to catch him. Our plan this time was to draw him into the cathedral with a precious artifact. And amp but he escaped with the artifact. Fortunately, one of the sisters put some secret markings on the artifact used- But he was too fast, and we couldn't even keep up with the trail. Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So t As far as I know, 
He was last seen near Springvale. Leave it to me. With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. Once we've got this raptor guy, we'll pick up where we left up, but no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with... This is Springvale. There must be the sister from the cathedral put some use your elemental sight and keep Ooh, hey, what do you think this is? It looks like a broken hmm, a strip of cloth with animal markings on it. Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wing glider. Wow, Outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon. Hmm, how do we know if animal slimes are air... Wait, are you... Either way, let's make a mental... It appears that the elemental markings point this... Huh, well, there's only one... Come on, we... Ooh, what's that? It sounds like they're quick. If this really belongs to Raptor, it must mean his wind glider is broken. Yeah. Come a little close. No, my sword! Thank goodness. The Knights of Favon. What happened? <sighs> Hilly Charles, but I... It's a small camp not too far from the village, but today... Hmm, now... Oh, it really riled them up. They chased the funny-looking fellow as I managed to get away, but they smashed my fruit carts to smithereens. Funny-looking? In what? Oh, he was holding on to something. Must have been heavy because he couldn't glide in a straight line to save his life. Maybe that's honestly. People like that shouldn't be allowed in the skies. It doesn't take a genius to know you're not supposed to carry heavy objects while gliding. I'm gonna report that idiot and make sure he gets his license re- Heavy object? The artifact? This could tell me. Did you see which way he... Uh, I managed to catch a glimpse as I ran from the hilly churls. I think he went... Seems like a strong lead. Oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get back, I'll tell the knights... Time to act. There's no... Cool it. Uh, suffocate! Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Apart from the hilly churls, there's a bunch of funny-looking people, too. Judging from the type of wind gliders they've got, I'd say th Huh. Look where we are. The elemental power on the artifact must have worn off. Raptor must have realized the markings would give away his position and sent his minions. That way, when the effect wears off, he can make his escape. He won't get away with this. After him! But if that's the case, what are they hanging around here for? There's only one way over there. Raptor must be up ahead. However, it looks like the only way we can catch up is if we glide. But there's a ton of enemies below. They'll definitely attack- If we're gonna do this, we'll have to glide and defeat- You still had one stage to go in your exam, right? Yeah, but what's that gotta do with anything? How about we make this the third and final stage of your gliding exam? Are you sure that's how the exam is supposed to go? It's a custom version of the exam, designed by yours truly. Besides, the normal version of the exam wouldn't be fit for the hero of Mondstadt himself. So, what do you say? Woohoo! Prepare for takeoff! Raptor awaits you once you defeat all these enemies. Then that gliding license is yours!
Natural. I knew you'd be fine. All that's left now is to grab ourselves a raptor. Let's go! Like there's no way across. Ugh, he must be around here somewhere. Amber! Over there! If you insist on chasing me, so be it. Huh? Who brought the little girl? You must be Raptor! You can't escape! <laughs> I don't need to escape. There's no way you can make it over here. 
Oh, it is pretty high. And quite far. Oh, little girl, why don't you run along home now and let your leader deal with this? Don't worry, I promise that once the Grandmaster gets here, I'll surrender immediately. <laughs> hey, watch it! You're talking to a Knights of Favonius Outrider! You'll be sorry when I arrest you! <sighs> You're right. Ugh, he's right there in front of us. If only we could glide across. <sighs> so how did he get across? If it's too far to glide, it's definitely too far for anything like that. There's also no sign of an anchor point. Bye-bye, kiddo. Oh, no! He's getting... Oh, we can't hesitate any longer. The... But... but... Don't worry. I'm the gliding champion of Mondstadt, remember? If Raptor can do it, I... Oi! Outrider! You have less chance of surviving this than jumping off the Animal God statue in Mondstadt without your wind gl... Point. If you rule out everything that's completely impossible, gliding is... Remember that book I lent you? The one I thought was the gliding manual, but what... The first birds couldn't fly. Flight was their reward for their cur... <sighs> Be my witness. Raptor says I'll never make it. But if you listen... Can... Wait! Stop! You'll never make it! Come on, off you go now. Back home like a... Raptor says I'll never make it. But if you... The wind... The wind says I will make it, and that's good enough for me. Amber! No! You're gonna fall! You're gonna fall! <gasps> it's a wind current! She, she's gliding! Amber's gliding! You're crazy, kid! You must have known about the wind current! There's no way you would have jumped otherwise! The wind takes care of those who have courage. Now sit still and await your arrest, like a good little boy. You're open. Yeah. Uh, picked the wrong test subject. No, my sword! I only noticed the wind current from in the air, and it's the only one. It would be suicide to try and escape in the direction Raptor was going. In other words, the only way Raptor could have gotten out would be this way, past us. Aha! So he was just trying to fool us by acting smug, in the hope that we would just give up and leave. Little did he know, we're not so easily fooled. It was all thanks to your sharp thinking. Just like a wise man once said, once you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, no matter how improbable, at the end of the day, gliding is seven parts technique, three parts instinct. What you did now looked more like 99 parts courage. Uh, it was just like in my first gliding exam. I was super nervous, but in the... I kind of missed that nervous rush in the exams I've done since then. It just... Um, sorry. Paimon thought you said you passed no problem. What do you mean exam since then? Uh, well, you see, the thing is, Mondstadt is all no glide zone this, no landing zone that. <sighs> Every time I get my license, it keeps getting revoked. I must have taken the exam about 15 times altogether, but I always pass the first time. I guess my little gliding manual ain't so bad after all. Let's go and get a copy of the real gliding manual from acting Grandmaster Jean sometime. I'll head off first because I need to escort Raptor back to the city. Once you're back in the city, don't forget to come find me at the cathedral. I'll issue your gliding license there. <sighs> she just can't sit still, can she? When this is all done and dusted, let's head to the... <sighs> Getting this gliding license has turned into quite the adventure.
body and mind. Congratulations! Here is your gliding license. I'm not surprised, though. You Oh, and I'll sign you up for the next wind gliding. Ch I glide so fast that no one can keep up. It's just me up there, on my own, gliding around. Whoa, fighting talk. <laughs> it seems you have... Well, until I kick your butt in the championship, I wish you a happy, liberating, and above all, law-abiding gliding experience. Make sure you obey the rules, whatever you do. Don't get your license revoked. Oh, brother. If you ask me, that's a bit rich coming from Amber. talking to someone. Let's let her finish, then go say hi. Which is what has brought us to this point in the first place. If you are unable to promptly deal with the storm terror threat, then leave the defense of Mondstadt to the Fatui. We can put an end to Mondstadt's dragon issues. All we need to do is bring that monster to the... <sighs> monster? Yes. What's your point? Uh... I'd expect a more professional attitude from your diplomats. Yet here you are saying you want to put an end to one of the four winds of Mondstadt? <sighs> I won't have any of this nonsense in front of the Knights of Favonius. <laughs> it's not as crazy as you make it sound. Fine, that's enough negotiation for today. At this stage, it's simply an amicable exchange of constructive opinions. No? I'll be sure to make... Thorough notes. Oh, you're back. Thanks for your help. The elemental flow is finally... S the aftermath of Storm Terror's last attack is finally settled for the moment. <sighs> However, the pressure from the delegation has become... Delegation? From Liyue Harbor or in Azuma City? Shneznaya. They choose to follow the god of Cryo. Their envoys go by a particular name, the Fatui. Heard of them? Oh, them? They're super famous! Wait, infamous is more the- I don't think killing Storm Terror is the right course of action. The Cryo Gods Fatui have always coveted the Animo God- I don't believe they have Mondstadt's best interests at heart. What is it? Oh, let us head back to headquarters then. We shouldn't discuss important matters out in the open. Mondstadt and Snechnaya are considered the same in status. Mondstadt is independent and does not belong to any other nation. In fact, despite being referred to as a city, Mondstadt is a nation. Though, Snechnaya's Fatui are known to be the most aggressive diplomats in it's a crystal embedded with some kind of power. Lisa, are you able to analyze it? Let me take a look. Hmm. I can see impurities in the crystal, but upon further inspection... No, I'm sorry. I can't make a proper analysis at the moment. Give me some time. I'll... D right. I'll leave the research to you then, Lisa. Understood. I'll notify you all if I make any progress. Though, I wouldn't go getting your hopes up. They were incredibly ancient texts, not to mention- Ouch! Gosh, that hurt! The impurities in the crystal- It hurts when I get close. Oh, I see. It appears to react to visions. The impurities and the elemental energy we embody repel each other. It's strange, though. You have elemental abilities as well, but don't seem to be affected in the same way. Anyway, the crystal would be better left in the hands of my cutie. It will just be a pain if left with us, both literally and metaphorically. 
Fascinating. Do you know anything about what makes you special? I do not know what to make of it either. Well then, the Knights of Favonius have another favor to ask of you. Please accept the title of Honorary Knight and the gratitude of the Acting Grand Master. Honorary Knight of Favoni? We ask for your continued assistance in finding some answers. <sighs> Storm Terror's rage and strange crystals. <sighs> I know Mondstadt's peace hangs in the balance. May the wind open your eyes to the truth. We'll meet back here if you find anything. didn't tell them. The dragon and the crystal weren't the only things we saw. So you do remember him! That green guy! He looked just like that guy down there! What? <laughs> that green guy disappeared. Use elemental sight to track... lead to this body and mind <gasps> time to act <laughs> What is to be sung transpired in days of yore, when the Divine Archons still walked the Earth? A dragon cast his curious gaze on the world below, as he parted from the heavens that gave his birth. The dragon sought truth amongst common folk, but mortal trifles only fogged his mind. The wind-born bard strummed his strings dulce, and the holy lyre answered his questions kind. The dragon was but a child full of wonder, and soared the heavens free from care. The bard's songs invited him to sing along, for he yearned to let all perceive him fair. Enchanting legends the bard and dragon were, but the tides of despair soon engulfed the land. The lion fang perished, and the falcon flag slept, as a vile dragon approached Mondstadt in low stand. Over the cathedral loomed death and his friends. Of the people's agony, the bard soon sang. The soaring dragon heeded his grave calls, and amidst the windstorms a brutal war sprang. Blood of venom sent the sky dragon into slumber. Only to awake to be expelled in abhor. Why do people in this age loathe me so? 
But the holy liar replied no more. Wrath and woe, vigor and venom, poured from the dragon's bitter eyes. The dragon's curse sprawled in silence, but the liar could no longer soothe his cries. Wait, you guys are... Oh, that's right. You're the ones that scared Dvalin away. Dvalin? Who's that? Huh? Oh, right! Most people seem to call him Storm Terror. Why do you call him that? Are you two meant to be close or something? Oh, so close. Hey, so... Paimon thinks this guy has a screw loose. Good day, Outlander. Seems we meet again. I'm Venti the Bard. Three-time winner of the most popular bard of Mondstadt, to be precise. So, what do you need from me? Given you recognize us, Paimon doesn't believe we need to explain any further. Of course it's about Storm Terror! Storm? Hey, cut it with the amnesia act! All right, show it to him. Oh, isn't this... What? The crystal has been purified? When? Dvalin, he... The anguish he feels has brought him to tears. Tears? He was once such a gentle child, now so full of rage and suffering. I also came across a teardrop crystal. Can you purify it? Have some wonderful of someone like you is going to end up getting written into a bard's poem. Oh, a hero so bright, should she stand in the light, though stand in the sh alas, I've really not the time to compose a melody. Anyway, even if Dvalin is not taken down, his life will still wither away in the breeze. He'll burn himself out in the flames of anger. I really must thank you for purifying the teardrop crystal. It is help, but I've already come to devise my own plan. Oh, and what plan would the seeing this tear has brought to mind a friend so deep? Friend? <laughs> One must be going. Hey, where are you running off to? To the symbol of Mondstadt's hero. Bye bye. Huh? What do you make of that? As far as he's concerned, you're a weirdo too, you know. Know what? Familiar? I don't know. But did he just say symbol of Mondstadt's hero? Oh, Paimon knows! It's that huge tree! Leave it to me. What are you doing here? Though I was just wondering if you would happen to follow me. You speak of the god of Animo, Barbados? Liyue and Inazuma's respective gods of Geo and Electro are still present, but Mondstadt has seen many a moon since they last saw their own god. Why do you wish to know about the god of Animo? Does it have something to do with Dvalin? Oh, uh, it's because gods... Just how is it that everyone sees Storm Terror? I'm quite curious. 
That said, there's no need to rush. I have not been back in a while. It seems there are a few who are unhappy with my arrival. in such a calm place. You think it was going after that green guy? His relationship with the wind seems even deeper than yours. No one escapes by sight. Wind blade, dodge this. The dragon wasn't the only thing affected by this change. Now then, you were saying someone had told you about the dragon? Is that so? Quite the scholar, I must say that, Lisa. She's not wrong. The conflict has reached this point only because both sides have resorted to the use. His hate, however, did not arise from the people not making tribute to the Four Winds, nor was it born from his own nature but instead came about as a product of his degradation. Degradation? The black blood flowing through his heart has been torturing him for years. That's what has allowed him to be led astray by the lies of the Abyss Mage. Correct. They are from the Abyss Order, an organization comprised of non-human... I don't know where they come from. All I know is that they hold deep hatred toward the human world. Many hilly trolls out in the wild take orders from them and act as their weapons. Before arriving here, I too was like Dvalin, cursed and left, but now, before us stands the symbol of Mondstadt's hero, the place from which the wind amongst the branches is good. I love the way it smells. Being here with you beneath this great tree feels like when the tear was purified earlier, like the poison is leaving my body. Feels so, how exactly did you get poisoned? Uh, that would- As a result, not only did I not manage to help Duvalin break his curse, but instead was also infected myself. Yes, it was you. So to make up for it, you're coming with me to the cathedral. The Mondstadt Cathedral? To do what? To claim a certain holy liar to him- <laughs> My experiment. What was that? Oh.
One of the most treasured items in Mondstadt. It's the lyre that Barbados used to play. With it, perhaps I can help Duvalin draw his gentle nature back out of this nightmare he's going through. Will it really stop Stormcare from causing more damage? Of course! I'm the best bard in the world. There's not a single song I do not know, no matter if it's from the past, present, or future. Look me in the eyes. Do you not find me trustworthy? <laughs> that one doesn't work on a bard. So how can we get the Holy Liar? It's said that it's enshrined deep within the cathedral, somewhere safe. I'll go take a look around. You can come if you want. handle this. Hello there, sister! May the Animo God bless you, young bard. Actually, I know a secret that can save Mondstadt from its current predicament. Oh, what a blessing from... But you should report that to the Knights of Favonius. <laughs> because you, dear sister, are... I'd like to borrow the Holy Liar. With it, I'll be able to help Storm... Please see yourselves out. What? It's a vicious dragon indeed, but once the acting Grandmaster makes up her mind, nothing can stand in the Knight's way. That's simply not acceptable. Wouldn't Storm Terror end up getting killed that way? That foolish beast betrayed the winds. Not even the god of Animo themselves would forgive it. Please, I beg of you. I'm afraid not, little bard. Strange. Somehow I feel so bad rejecting this sweet child. Then... I guess I'm left with no other choice. I cannot hide anymore. My disciples... Rejoice! Behold! The god of Animo, Barbados, has descended! Shocked, aren't you? Don't you just want to cry out and rejoice? How does it feel to finally meet the god you've been serving? If there's nothing else, I'll be going back to handle the cathedral's paperwork now. Oh, wait! Huh? She didn't even bat an eyelid. But I have at least learned what I wanted to know. She didn't deny that the cathedral is enshrining the whole... Now, since you're the hotshot of the Knights of... F Maybe you can give it a shot. Barbados bless you. I know you. You and Amber saved Mondstadt. So what brings you here? Tat, is that so? Not that I don't trust you. It's just that a suspicious bard came looking to borrow the holy... He's full of nonsense and even called himself Barbados. He must be up to something. There are regulations in place for the use of the Holy Lyre. Currently, it's only used in Ludihar Pastum. Signed documents from the Grand Master, Seneschal, and Community Representative are all required. So, may I see the document from the Knights of Favonius? A signed document is required. Now, if you'll excuse... Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> You... I just wanted to know how influential the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius is. You see, the best warrior should always be presented with the best. Does the story not make for... So what are you trying to say? No, that's not it. More of a commentary regarding monster... Very well. Looks like borrowing it is not good. Today we stand for free... Come now, speak up. That's what free will is. <laughs> Look at you. S but seriously, you're more suitable. Aside from singing, I don't really have any other talents. Besides... If I was caught, I'd have no one to write the grave- How can it be a grave injustice if you got caught stealing- The things are different for you. You are the superstar of the night. Should you get caught, you would easily be able to talk your- The guards here. It seems they're off due. If we manage to seize this opportunity- Stop mentioning us getting caught! What do you say? 
Ah, uh, yes. Seems I did. Your point being? Why does your decision hinge upon whether or not I am a god? Paimon will fill you in on her background story when we get the time. Huh? What are you doing oh, here? No, run! Oh no! We're busted! Run! What? Follow me! Master D. Luke, this is this week's accounts. <sighs> the disaster. Well, let's hope it all ends soon. Hi! We'd like a seat at your, uh, least conspicuous. Um, the second floor has fewer customers. You'd be le But aren't you a bard? Why not sit front and center? <laughs> let's save the paid performance for next time. We'll hey, keep an eye on them. There's something strange about that. Ask who, exactly? The protectors of Monster. Uh, Master D, look! Have you seen two thieves around? What happened? Why have you mobilized so many guards? <sighs> Haven't you heard, Master D, look? Two thieves are trying to steal the Holy Liar! Huh? How odd. Isn't it? The Holy Liar is a treasure that was played by the god of animal themselves. Such a precious piece of cultural heritage. Why would one want to steal something they can't sell off? Would pay better to steal from my sellers. Huh? Sorry, off topic. Believe they headed that way. Understood. Thank you, Master Diluc. Today, I think I'll have a glass of... You can put down that bottle you stole from behind the counter. Something cold. Right. I want answers. 
Let me finish my drink first. I'll pay you. Well, with a performance. It's not about money. You seem too young to be drinking. No need to worry. When I started drinking, you were still... Oh, you want to ask, who's this? Him. He is Master Deluc, the boss of... the... Uh, the owner of this tavern. He's very famous. By the way, his dandelion wine is one of my favorite. Although most of the time I can only afford a bottle or two. I just heard about some thieves from the guards. For the record, I like your guts for trying to steal the Holy Lyo de Hamel, even if you are fools. But we don't often get to see people like you. It wasn't us that stole it. The real thief is still out there. This is the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius. Why would someone so aspiring steal Mondstadt's sacred treasure? Hotshot? Oh, so it's you. So, you and the Bard are close friends? Well, despite only being a passing traveler, you still offered your help to shame you joined the Knights. The Knights of Favonius. <laughs> and towards the Fatui? Weak. <sighs> Forget it. I don't feel like talking about- Seems you don't really like the Knights of Favonius. Just differences in approach is all. I have my own hopes for this city. Now, answers. Why did you steal the whole- You sure you want to know? It could implicate you in the affairs of the- That's fine. I somehow always end up implicated in their- If I tell you the story with a performance- It depends. I'll make my own judgment. Then will I get paid? Your reward will range from anywhere between five Mora and the Holy Liar. It all depends. Very well. What did I just witness? This is confidential information. Why did you- Why? Hmm. Perhaps the winds are changing. What say you, Master Dilu? Interesting. Give me some time. Outlander, as one of the knights, it seems you're not a suspect. Blonde is the only description on the wanted poster. You should be safe. As for the bard, however, it'd be better if you stayed in the tavern. <laughs> no problem. I like to- <sighs> Okay. Let's meet here t- You're here. Wait, you're... Well, first of all, I contacted... Secondly, she came here as Jean herself, not as the... A Jean you would never see, even as an honorary... What a surprise. I heard about the Holy Liar, but I never suspected it was... So, the sound of the Holy Liar can purify Storm Terror and return it to normal? Is that... That's right! Your honorary knight is putting themselves on the front line to try and res- Now that's the hot shot of the Knights of Favonius I'm talking about. Feels like we're breaking the law, though. I understand this kind of absurd explanation is hard, but we can ask the Bard to play the song again. I believe you. To persuade our stubborn command- I can't think of any reason for Devalin's betrayal, given it was once one of the Four Winds. However, if it was poisoned in the battle over Mondstadt all those years, and then corrupted by the Abyss Mage after it woke up, we can't- But as Acting Grandmaster, I obviously cannot make such diplomatic pressure from the Fatui makes it hard for us to seek a peaceful- People would think I've lost grip on the gravity of the situation. Mm -hmm. That's one of the reasons I don't like the Knights of Favonius. What surprises me is that you would believe an outlander so easy- My cautious and meticulous superior, even you trust him, don't you, sir? <sighs> I already told you not to call me, sir. Never mind. Uh... <clears throat> wow. Um, this is really awkward. I have a rough idea of where the Holy Liar de Hamel is. Nice recovery. She's really talented at changing the subject. The conflict between Mondstadt and Shneznaya stems from the conflict between the Seven Nations and their... The Cryogods Fatui seem to be after the Animo Gods... Uh... Right. If the Knights of Favonius publicly prevented an attempt, the only other way to affect the Animo Gods... The number of Fatui that have come to Mondstadt is far from lit. I've already managed to... 
co- DeLuke has determined that the holy liar is not being held in- I imagine they don't want to leave something stolen in a- Paimon gets it! If too much of- <laughs> Such is the diplomacy between the- Outlander. Jean just said the Fatui are trying to take Devalin's power for the- I fear this might fall short of their true intentions. I think they intend to use Barbados' connection to the wind to draw him out. Just like Lisa traced the source of the storm to the temples. Floor's defenses have been broken. Uh, 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 no, don't! I have uh, We hid the liar in the depths of these rooms. The place is being kept as li I don't know which one of the guards has. This guy looks like he's about to wet him. You, you just worry about it. one of the eleven is already in Mondstadt. Senora, when she gets her hands on you, she's gonna string you up and torture you. Did he say Senora? What a strange name. Number eight of the eleven goes by the name Senora. So we can run them up across the Seven Nations like they do is entirely because of the Eleven. We need to act quickly before she gets wind of what's going on. Shnezna. Are you here to play with me? <laughs> with the wind! Let me amuse myself. Huh? Huh. Animal test 60. Cool it!
I'd scurry out from. Senor's not going to tolerate this kind of interference in our affairs. So I'll be able to take care of you. You've heard the trouble of having to deal with you herself. Senora is going to end you. The songs Bard sing of your demise will be so terrifying. Big talk for a guy who still ran off in the end. Chicken. Are your adventures going smoothly? It is always that way when you are starting out. Preparing properly before an adventure can help things go more. It seems that you have a wealth of experience under your belt now. Time the guild receives requests from far and wide each day and assigns commissions to adventure. These commissioned adventures are the main source of what kind of commissions? It is a mixed bag. Anything from running an errand for fellow citizen, but you do not have to take my word for it. Here you can find the details. Please report back to me upon completion. Excellent. I knew I await your return with great anticipation. Add Astra. Welcome back! Oh, this is the Holy Liar! You managed to retrieve it! The pattern of flowing wind carved... What do you think, Venti? Can you summon Devalin? Mm, although this liar is the real thing, as you can see, the liar has been through a thousand years of history. In this condition, you couldn't play music fit for even Diluc's tavern with it. Bards fight to get on the stage of my tavern. Don't make assumptions. <sighs> Is that really important right now, Master? And you! Did you just borrow the Holy Liar to play music for drunk? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> anyway, we won't be able to call Devalin with it. The Liar itself is fine, but the strings... You're up, Outlander. Relax, it's not broken. It's just that the intensity of its animo power has greatly diminished. Do you still have Devalin's teardrop crystal with you? Great! Try to use it on the Holy Liar! It worked as expected. This youthful glow. Praising yourself? Re I was talking about the Holy Liar. Thanks to our traveler friend having purified the crystal, the Holy Liar won't continue to lose power. That said, its power is far from replenished. It'd be great if we could get more tears. How can we gather more? I can surmise that Devalin will already be crying. Suffering alone in some deserted place. <sighs> Devalin. Poor baby. This is not something that an honorary knight can accomplish alone. I will mobilize the rest of the knights to assist. 
When you get the teardrop crystal, please let our honorary knight perform the purification. Heroes supporting each other and setting out on a journey together. How exciting! Let me come up with a song for you. Is that all you're going to do? Just sing? Hmm, wouldn't be much of a bard if I didn't know. <laughs> you're so cheeky. You deserve an ugly nickname. Oh, Paimon knows. From now on, you'll be known as Tone Deaf Bard. This search reminds... Six months ago, a thief stole treasure from the East Temple of the Four Winds. Whoa, what was it? A cup used by Barbados? No. Although, if such a thing existed, it would be very valuable. Among all the relics they managed to dig up, one particular object was very rare. It was a vial which contained the animal god's breath. Relics come in every shape and form, huh? Anyone with an eye for fine art would like to add this relic to their collection. Once word got out, the Fatui started trying to seek it out as well. They've made tons of counterfeits that can be found everywhere. In response, I just bought everyone I could find, irrespective of its authenticity. We're still at... I've bought more than 2,000 fakes to date, and the Fatui are yet to find the real one. Whoa, you guys are insane. So it means the real one must be out there somewhere on the black market, right? Hmm. Paimon will give you a discount on them if she finds any, because Paimon's just great like that. Sure, you can try to find the real one. I'll take what you find, even if they're fake. Once you're done, find me at the winery. I'll trade you a beer for every 20 you find. Answer from this world? Outlines your fate. Know my sword. Drink. Animal hypostasis. As knights, we are taught to hone our investigate. Wow! In my experience, the secret to finding what you are looking for is to never look for it in the first place. Don't think too much about it and don't search too hard. And before you know it, what you're looking for will appear right before your very eyes. What? Outrider Amber, reporting. Don't worry about it too much. The more flustered you become, the less likely you are to find it. Pay attention to what you see in your peripheral vision, and you might just stumble upon what you're looking for. Chivalry will... I don't know. It doesn't sound like that would work. No, seriously, it does, though. In fact, it's how I used to find my tortoise whenever he went missing. Wait! You had a pet tortoise? Yes, why? Something wrong, Paimon? No, it's, uh, well, just surprising is all. Why? Paimon can't imagine Jean having a pet tortoise. I want to help. No, I don't. I had one too when I was a kid. What's so strange about it? What? You too? Is this an answer from this world? Freeze! Cool it! <laughs> Qu 
quite the find. Fascinating. Quite the fine. Excellent. your fate. How 
fortunate. What's the hurry? I want to help. Is this an answer from this world? Mm-hmm. <sighs> 